Hello everyone, this is Ujwal Gandhi from SpatialThoughts.com. Today I want to share a quick QGIS tip to work with raster data. A very commonly asked query is, how do I shift or rotate my raster in QGIS? Uh, maybe you have a georeference raster that is misaligned by just a few meters, or you may want to apply a slight rotation to your raster. This is actually very simple, and you can do this with very little effort in QGIS. Let's learn. Here we are in QGIS 3.28. I've loaded a really nice high resolution raster from Open Aerial Map. Let's say you want to move this raster by five meters to the right. Uh, we want the solid georeference. As you can see, this has got uh, it's in a UTM projection and we want to just shift the raster without really changing or messing the projection. This can be done using the built-in georeferencer. It's available under layer georeferencer. Note that in the recent versions of QGIS, this has been moved from the raster menu under the layer menu because it can now georeference both raster, raster as well as vector. Let's open the same image in the georeferencer. I'm going to go to the set transformation settings and choose the option linear. I'm going to name my output file. Let me just name it as test. Okay. We'll keep uh, the compression option as deflate and rest will just use zero for transparency. For the linear transformation, we need to show two tie points. I'm going to click anywhere on the image. Uh, when I'm asked for the coordinates, for now, I'm just going to enter zero, zero. And I'm going to do the same for the next point. It helps if those points are a little further away, two corners of the image. And now I get this GCP table. I'm going to edit the destination X and Y coordinate to be the same as source X and Y. So I'm going to go here and copy and paste those coordinates here. So you can see I have the same X and Y coordinates as a source and target, and all my errors and everything is zero. Now you can decide how much you want to shift this image in which direction. Let's say we want to add five meters to the X coordinate. So this image will shift right. I uh, will take this image, whatever is the number, I'm going to add that number. And we add five to it. So this will become 582. Uh, same with the destination X, I'm going to make it from 813 to 818. That's it. We're done. We now added the five meters to the X coordinate. And when we georeference this image, this image will shift right. Let's go and click run. The georeferencing was successful, and you can see the new image has been loaded to QGIS. If I toggle the layers, you can see this image, the new image is shifted to the right by five meters. We can also verify this. Let's just zoom in somewhere here. This is a really nice high res image, so we can zoom in really far. Uh, let me just go and measure this. I'm going to click on this uh, corner of the tail light of this car, and I'm going to find the same corner, and you can see my uh, distance between those two images is five meters. Hope you enjoyed this tip. If you want to learn georeferencing in detail, I have a couple of really nice step-by-step -step tutorials, which I've linked in the description. Thank you.